What's up, fellas? All right, today we're gonna do the barrel stove. Uh, I'm gonna do the the double part of it, the top part of it uh, later on this summer. Really, all I need is some just something to keep me warm in here while I'm working uh, during the winter. Plus, I want to burn this barrel off before I use it because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a smoker out of the top, the second part of it. So I'll just light it like a little cold fire in the bottom, and it'll smoke up and gather in the top, and then out the top of the damn thing. But uh, that's what I want. I want it uh, to be a smoker. So I'm going to heat my workshop during the winter with it and then I'm going to use it as a smoker during the summer. So let's get to work on it. Alright, here's what we got. We're going to do this outside. I got this old barrel. Been laying around for a while. And I got this barrel stove. Now let me tell you. I got this on eBay. And you look at this right here. On the picture that I bought, I looked at, because here's what I did first. On eBay, it said double barrel stove kit. Okay, it did say nothing about no adapter. And it had a picture of this. Now, what would you think you were buying if it has a picture of this and it says kit there? You would think, yeah. Okay, here's what comes in this. This part up here this part right here and these two legs that's all that's in there that's all that's in there right yeah then you go back on ebay all of a sudden there's just the single there and it's more than the I, I, I just don't understand but anyway they have don't be fooled by these fuckers because the one that I bought, the picture on eBay, had this right here in white, right here. Vogelzang, nice looking door. I mean, it was a beautiful door. It did not say barrel stove on it, right? <sighs> so when I get it, it says barrel stove. It says barrel stove kit. This whole thing. The picture was completely different than this on the eBay listing. They had this on eBay, and it was cheaper than the one that had this on the door. Do you understand what I'm saying? I ordered this one and got this one, which was cheaper in the first place. Watch these fuckers. If you want to build this thing, buy the cheapest one you can find, because it's cast iron, it's Chinese, and it's cheap. But it'll do what you want it to do. All right, let's do it. Put it together.
It's a little bit cold today. Not that bad though. Not that bad. It was supposed to be snowing. And I, I made this thing outside because I didn't want to drag it in and out. <coughs> it, uh, the barrel wasn't exactly the cleanest barrel, but uh, it had been sitting around for a while, and I need to get, I need to use it. And I'm getting a 30 gallon for the top, and I'm a, it's not a, a, it didn't have any petroleum distillates in it, I guess. This barrel has been sitting around. It sat around at a place I worked for for a long time, empty, uh, open. Everything evaporated out of it. There could still be residue in it. I know there's paint on the outside of it. I don't want to be breathing that while I'm burning it out. So I'm going to burn the barrel in. I'm lighting a big old roaring fire, not a huge, gigantic, blow it up, turn it red fire, but I'm lighting a fire in there. And uh, I'm going to burn everything out of it. And I'm going to burn it all winter. That's why I'm not putting the second part on it. I'm going to burn it all winter and get all that crap out of it. And then that's going to be my smoker this summer. But yeah. Uh, We'll show you what that looks like during the summertime, but uh, things I, I could probably tell you, uh, order the cheap one, because if you order the expensive one, you still get the damn cheap one, uh, or communicate better with them than I did. I didn't communicate. I just ordered it, but uh, make sure of what you're ordering. At first, it'll tell you double barrel stove kit. Don't order that. That's the just the legs and the connector. Order the barrel stove kit not the double barrel stove kit the double barrels nothing barrel stove is the door in the top and the, and the legs uh, burn it out outside first because it's going to burn all the all the paint off of it anything that's noxious in that barrel is going to burn off uh, i knew about barrel stoves because my daddy made a, a one and we heated his 80 by 40 shop building when i was a kid with a barrel stove uh, yeah, he just whipped it up in 15 minutes. <laughs> the old man was awesome. But yeah, all right. I guess uh, I guess that's it. Really, I don't think there's anything you really need to know other than that. It, it was simple, easy. Uh, don't cut your damn self, because I cut myself on the barrel. A little shard or something on there. Uh, and make sure it's empty when you start cutting on it. And no, uh, nothing's going to catch on fire or the barrel won't explode whenever you cut into it because it's got gasoline in it or something don't be a freaking idiot anyway other than that i can do it you can do it because uh it's so easy there ain't nothing to it but to do it all right y'all have a good one little doggy